Many education tools, such as Google Forms, do not have options for superscripts like exponents or subscripts. There are some add-ons that will help you enter a photo or code of an equation or expression. You can also use the caret key to annotate an exponent. However, the caret key doesn't match the style of the equation in any format, almost outside of coding. There's got to be a better way. And there is, Kevin. Instead, you can simply use the superscript generator. The superscript generator is a browser-based site that will turn any text into a superscript. Once the superscript is generated, all you need to do is copy it by right-clicking or hitting Control-C. Once you've selected and copy it, all you need to do is paste this exponent into the field by right-clicking or hitting Control-V. The same issue happens when you're trying to create subscripts, like you might see when organizing or labeling variables in math and science. You can use add-ons that'll create photo or embedded code of the equation. You can even try to find alternative keystrokes. Again, you can just simply use the subscript generator. Subscript generator is a browser-based site that'll turn any text into a subscript. Once the subscript is generated, all you need to do is copy it by right-clicking or hitting Control-C after you've highlighted the text. Now all you need to do is paste this subscript label into the field by right-clicking or hitting Control-V. Properly formatted super and subscripts are much clearer for students, and they reflect how students will see these values represented in other academic environments. This will lead to the format being less overwhelming for students and staff alike.